Hello. Today I am doing the Falling Leaves route, which is a sporty run by Dulwich Paragon. Also, I'm not doing the actual sporty right now, but I basically took the route they do. I think they start at Hearn Hill. There's a lot of climbing. So I've done one big hill already. I've still got Toys Hill, half of Toys Hill, as far as Puddle Duck Lane, and Brasted Hill to do. But it works out about 60 miles, increasing the distance a little bit more again, following on from the 57 last week. I've had a headwind the whole way down, but I've just kind of hit the turning point, and then there'll be a tailwind all the way home, which hopefully will help push me up Toys Hill a bit. We'll see. So uh, I guess I should talk to you about my new wheel, shouldn't I? Hello. I'm on my way back from Panagua, local bike shop in Hayes, because my new wheels arrived today and I'm getting them fitted. If you saw my last video, you will know that the rear wheel has a dent in it. Just decided to get a new wheel set I just went for a budget option because my longer term plan is to get a new bike either later this year or early next year then use my current bike as my commuting slash winter bike so I didn't feel a lot of need in getting some expensive wheels which would probably be double the value of what the bike is now because the bike itself is 10 years old I bought it second hand two years ago for 600 pounds. I could have got a nice wheel set and then when I got the new bike, put them across, but I'd rather save the money at the moment. So getting the wheels to Pinagua was actually a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. I just threaded the leather straps on my rucksack through and basically just cycled there. So I had these fitted and dropped off yesterday and they're very nice. 
and I don't know if it's a placebo effect or not, but they feel faster, they spin more easily, pretty sure they're lighter as well. Yeah, quite happy with them. However, I need to get a new rear derailleur because it's pretty much just seized up, which I kind of knew already. So when I dropped the wheels off to be fitted, I asked the guys to take a look at it and yeah, it needs replacing, but they didn't have any in stock. They could order some, but it wouldn't arrive until middle of July. I just went online and ordered them myself, ordered the part, and then when that arrives, hopefully this week, I'll take them back to Panagua and get them fitted. I'm a little bit disappointed with Panagua, to be honest. I basically, I asked them to, to put the old derailleur back on because it's still rideable, just not very good. And they did put it back on, but in such a state, like they pretty much missed out the upper sprocket entirely. I mean, it's fortunate that I know enough about bikes that I could fix it. And if they brought that back to someone else, maybe someone who's just started cycling after commuting to work and stuff, they might not know that it's quite an easy fix, but it wasn't in a rideable state at all. I only noticed it when I tried to ride it. And I'm glad I did do a little test run before I came out today. I'll mention it to them when I take the bike back in for the rear derailleur to be fitted and I'll see what they say.